you too. What's up with y'all? It's y'all boy Lucky Donnie. I'm back with another video, real quick, real soon. Today video, I'm be running a little um, errand run. I actually gotta get a oil change for my Mustang, and I'm gonna show y'all what I do after I get an oil change because if y'all know, coyotes are known to have the coyote tick, and mines have it real bad. I'm gonna let y'all hear after I get this cold start. But that's not all we doing today. As y'all can see, my car is dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty car. Not really dirty, it's just dusty. From driving in that grass. Whatever. But without further ado, let's get this cold start. I know that's what y'all wanna see. God damn, this shit dusty. Right now we actually headed to Walmart to get a oil change. I know I don't change my oil, my own oil. I can, but the time and cost it's about the same. So I rather just have Walmart change it. And if y'all don't Walmart, ugh, if y'all don't know, Walmart do change oil for a better price than the oil shops. So putting y'all on. Also, I gotta um, exchange these diapers. So you know, knock out two birds and one stone. Okay, I did end up getting the, um, the oil change. And shout out to Walmart, man. The um, guy was super, he was a Mustang fan, so that helped me. He uh, recommend I get a, um, a catch can and get my oil changed even often than I do. So, shout out to him. But Walmart did not have the um, the Ceratech. That's what it's called. The Ceratech that I put in my car. So I'm about to head to somewhere that I do know have it. All right, we just arrived at the car wash and let me show y'all something. Well, let me let y'all hear something. Yeah, I got coyote tick pretty bad. I'm gonna go ahead and wash my car cause it's pretty filthy. Don't ever use this brush right here. You see that? Don't use that. That will ruin your paint. I know some people, I know you still using that brush. But right now, I got it nice and wet. I'm gonna go ahead and towel dry it. I'm not supposed to do it in the bay, but there's nobody here. And it's real bright outside. So I'm gonna go ahead and wipe this down. And then I'm gonna go pick up the Ceratec. Looks much better. Here. Such a gorgeous car. Can't lie. You know, you spend hours drying it. As soon as you move, more water just drip off the head. Like my paint ain't in the best condition, but I mean, still, still, still a sight to be seen. I don't know. What somebody say in my uh, comments? Yeah, you gotta lower that 4x4 Mustang. I promise y'all, it's coming, it's coming. I got some other mods to do first before I can lower it. So let's just admire this thing with the shit. Now we actually hit it to go pick up that Ceramitech. That Ceratech, my fault. Yeah, we hit it there to pick up the Ceratech. And that'll be the end of the video. Y'all see me putting it in. Man, I didn't know this was going to be such a long video. I tried to, I thought it was going to be like 10 minutes at most. It's probably going to be like a 15, 12 minute video. But make sure y'all like and comment and subscribe. Let me know if y'all put Ceratech in y'all Mustang after after each oil change. Or even if y'all have the, um, the coyote.
coyote tick. But I'm in a rush, so let's hurry up and go get this Ceratec. I finally got it. Damn, I can't even pick it up. I finally got it. I went to, I kid you not, let's see. I went to the first store, then I went to five different AutoZone stores, auto parts stores, and they did not have it. I'm in the middle of fucking nowhere. I don't know where the hell I'm at. It's a Mustang right there. You check him out now. You can't see me now, but I salute you. But I finally got it, y'all. I'm going to go back home because I don't want to put it in here because I literally don't know where I'm at. I'm going to actually order some of these off Amazon for my next oil change because I don't want to go through. I, wanna, I don't know where the hell I'm at. I don't want to come back here. Bam, Ceratec. Put this in your engine after every oil change. I'm going to show y'all how to put it in. It's very simple. Yeah, I just made it home. And I'm about to show you how to use this. So, wait, before I, I gotta get my thumbnail. All right, so now that I got my thumbnail, um, what you wanna do is, I'm gonna shake this up before use, cause that's what it say on the can. And you wanna, oh, let me set this thing. You wanna take, this off right here. I should have left my car running just so y'all can hear it work. I promise this stuff works. And you wanna pop the top on this. There you go. Got that pot, you just want to add it straight in the whole can. should fix your um ticking problem if you have any um i know my car ticks bad without it and it says use it after every preferably after every um you know oil change so that's what i do i'm gonna change this i just gotta watch a youtube video on exactly how to wash it i mean not change i'm gonna change that everything else yeah let me see Hope y'all enjoyed the video, the little car vlog. Um, I didn't expect this video to be long. If it's that long, I'm sorry about that. But if y'all like the video, make sure y'all leave a thumb up. Comment if y'all um use that, the liquid moly Ceratec. Comment if y'all use it. I know I've been using it for the last past four oil changes. So yeah. So make sure y'all subscribe too.